Good morning, students. The comparison of polarization of conductors and electrics in the external electric field. Whenever we apply the external electric field, plus and minus charges get separated. Okay. But the separation method is different uh, for the conductors and uh, insulators. Dielectric means insulators only, like glass, plastic, etc. For always conductor, you take a, you find three electrons. Conductor is the electrons in three, so electrons will move from uh, one side to the other side of those electric fields. So when the electrons accumulate the same number of positive charges, losing electrons, the electrons take a positive charge as well. And we call this as a free charge. Free charge is something that move freely. That means, in case of the polarization effect, if you touch, these electrons will go from your body to the ground. Okay, if you touch this side, the electrons will flow from ground to this side so that this will not get neutralized. The conductor is charging more freely from the surface of the thing to the surrounding medium. It is possible for the polarizing conductors. What about the field inside? In, because of plus and minus polarizing material, electric field is induced from plus to minus or the unit charges inside the material. So the Z naught is outside of it and Z naught is everywhere. So inside this one electric field, there are two fields are there. One is induced electric field coupled to external field. Okay. And uh, external field is also there. Then the resultant field becomes equal to E naught minus E induced. But for the case of conductors, sir, E used is equal to E naught. Both are equal and opposite. Okay, you can take it between the vectors or not. You can take it as a minus sign. Either vector or minus sign. Equal and opposite directions. So net field becomes equal to net electric field inside the conductor is equal to E naught minus E inside equal to zero. So conductor is electrically neutral. So inside this conductor, this is E naught equal to zero, which is the difference of the two electrons. In the case of the conductors, charges can move easily to the surroundings. So, the conductor even if it is polarized also, charges can be not to the surrounding air possible. So, discharging thing, that is for discharging, losing the charges is called the discharge. But in the case of the insulators, for polarized air paper, induced electric field is less than that of the external applied electric field and opposite direction. Net electric field inside the polarized air paper is nothing but equal to E0 minus E inside, but E inside is induced electric field inside is less than E0, therefore, difference is not equal to zero. So, polarized air insulator. Polarized insulator has electric field inside the house. But the polarized connected electric field inside is zero. The point already inside the connected electrical neutral it is. Here also electrical neutral only actually because these are not charges. These charges cannot lead to surroundings easily because they are strongly bound to nucleus atom only actually in this case. And uh, but the polarization because the polarization is what gets separated from the, the molecules rotation or in the molecules plus minus separation may produce this polarization. So in this case, we call it as a polarized surface charges. That's a very simple indicator. Polarized surface charges, they are not free charges like the dark conductors. Plus is plus, negative is minus. Plus or minus sigma p is polarized. Surface charge. Lenses. Means not free charges. Free charges means charges that can move freely, so the free charges. Polar charges are not free charges, they can move freely. We didn't draw the diagram, we didn't draw the molecules, they are not just the electrons, they are molecules only, they cannot come out of these materials. But very strong electric field you have taken, very strong electric field you have taken, it is possible to make the electrons also pass through the insect. There is no perfect insect, there is no perfect dielectric in the nature. Strong electric field, so it happens. Inside the conductor, electric field is zero, but inside the electric field, electric field is not equal to zero. This is one thing important. This details will not they won't ask, but once the final result only that is important, and diagram also must be identified for the quantity of this purpose. And what is the relation between the this resultant field? Is nothing but related to equal to this, this E inch inside. Is nothing but equal to upright field by K, which is nothing but what is a T medium inside the medium. T medium is E not by K, where K is the direct constant.
part is capacitance. Another method, neutral plate, then two different methods. One method is 
take the neutral plane. By keeping the neutral plane close to the charger plane, we can increase capacity by some amount. How? This plus uh, attack the electrons from this plane B from right side surface to left side surface. So electrons will come because the attack the plus uh, they come and activate this side. This neutral, so same amount of plus will be on side. So this plus uh, plus the repulsion will be there. Plus minus attraction also there, both will be there. But if minus is closer than plus, so attraction is stronger than uh, repulsion. Uh. So some charges will go wide stay inside when the attraction of the negative charges. But uh, still there is a limit here beyond this which, which cannot uh, increase the capacity of this plane. Okay. But decrease the distance uh, also will increase the attraction by the minus, but at the same time repulsion also dominates. So there is a limit for this to increase the capacitance. Next method of key is by keeping this one method. Next method of key is by keeping the after conductor, after conductor near to the plane T and it is already charged into the cross charges. And I'm keeping the other connector near this. Or B you take it, like this you get the charges. And uh, this is plus. Now I'm doing the connecting this to the Connecting this to the What happens now? At this, every connector, connected with the primary become neutral. And its potential is always uh, zero. At the potential is zero. The difference of the shot is because the energy potential is zero, F also potential is zero. We got this potential to take as zero because net charge is always zero. So in this case, uh, F is uh, neutral and it will be try to become neutral, try to become neutral, may not be able to become, try to become neutral. So the result is that this plus charge is this error supplies error also so that this fourth charge is neutralized. Fourth charge cannot be this, only electrons can move. So electrons will go here, four fourth charge means four electrons will go. We say fault charges are discharged to wrong reasons. This is the other thing. Then what I can say is only limit charges are there. Okay, why limit charges are not going to there? They also want to go, but attraction is making them to stand there. This fault charges attract limit charges with the attraction, they can't move that they stay when they are Okay, and this is the distance between these two. The distance between the plane speed is reduced. Attraction increases. There is no repulsion in the room, attraction is there. As the distance is decreased, the attraction increases, sir. Then what happens is the more charges on left side to go and stay outside. This is also called as condensation. Condensed, in the case of condensed materials, sir, we get the molecules and particles very close to each other. The happens is decrease from the condensation. So here also what happens is charges are getting condensed. So by these devices, this arrangement of the device, the bulk of the negative breaks, charges breaks, other surfaces, is also called as a condenser. This is also called as a capacitor, this is a device. So plus charges on the side, minus charges on the side. And less the distance, sir, more pulse charges will go on and stay inside. But now places are being captured still, surfaces are there. I can add more charges. They don't stay here, they come and stay here because I am contracted by this and any negative charges here, they are coming from the earth. So this arrangement is nothing but we are going to divide the principle and the principle of capacitors. Principle of capacitors is that by keeping F the conductor, F the conductor close to the charge conductor, the capacitor of the conductor can be increased. Not F the conductor capacitor we are talking here, the charge other plane will be. We want to increase the capacitor in this A. For the purpose, you have to keep the earth connector. What if earth is not never available for you? Then in that case, what I will do is we keep the two plates plus and minus plates. Uh, sorry, plates A and B. Okay, go separate by some distance the direct inside. A is also inside, black is also inside. But that is what we will have the experiments with. We take here only as a direct between these two. Now connect this A and B to the back is the back is. Plus minus. Every battery cell has uh, two electrodes. One is positive electrode, another one is negative electrode. Positive and negative, with respect to zero, is a higher potential plus, uh, and with respect to zero, is minus, is lower potential. Plus is more potential than that, uh, minus. So, battery cell, if you are taking, for example, the house of battery cell, dry cell, they are not actually dry. It can be inside a wet or metal will be there, a lot of light. Okay, how much you have to do with the inside the product? It's a paste. Very dry cell, not a dry cell, dry cell. But not ever. This is what a dry cell in the house is what we use, not dry cells are not recharged cells. In that case, plus minus will be there and it is written as 1.5 volts. 1.5 volts is the potential difference between the two electrodes, plus and minus. That means plus this with respect to zero, this is 0.75 volts. With respect to zero, this is minus 0.75 volts. What does the total difference become, sir? 0.75 minus or minus plus 0.75 equal to 1.5. So the potential difference with respect to zero, this is the voltage of this side. With respect to the neutral, this voltage of this one. But difference between these two will be 1.5 volts. 
of the cell. That is the production difference between the two cutting surface cells when not connected to cell groups. It is also called as a EMF, which is the cable. So, this battery symbol will be like this. Plus means a bigger line electric vehicle, minus means a smaller line electric vehicle. This minus plus this are what potential difference between the two terminal surface cells. This is nothing but we call battery cell. Battery and cell. Battery means collection of the energy points. Cell has electrical energy inside stored with chemical production energy. So this cell, if you connect one of the other two cells, if you connect together, that is called as a battery. Cell is closed surface. From any side, if you close it, it is called as a cell. Okay. Even polyester cell also cell because it is closed from all sides. Even J also cell is a cell because it is also in the closed from all sides. So this is called as a cell. Here also we call it as a cell because the chemical components are closed up inside this containers. Okay. And uh, about the battery cell, we will discuss again here about the properties. Here this is a battery cell. Potential difference is B. This is called as a battery. Battery is actually more than one cell. In some kind of battery is even like this. These are two cells added here. Plus minus. Plus minus. It's connected. It's two cells. Voltage will be added. One point by one point by means three volts. Like that we have taken series emissions. In the same order. Plus minus. Plus minus. Now what happens? Battery provides the potential difference. Potential difference is that means that is in pass. Same potential means equivalent surfaces. Charge is not pass. There is no work done. Now battery doing the work to take the electrons from one plate to other plate. In that case, in two cases, what we say is the plate side, the battery minus connected to the plate, that gets the negative charges. So electrons are supposed to stay on the surfaces. And the other side will get the plus charges. Same number of things. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Minus how many are there? Plus also same number of things. This is the plus few means, this is minus two. Plus sigma means minus sigma. Minus sigma. Same surface charge the same point, plus or minus the point by A. So the same plate area will be discussed here. If we even if we take unequal plate area, I will take only the smaller plate area effect or not the bigger plate area effect. So here in this case, the extent of the plate is D. Battery is doing the work, the battery cell is doing the work to move the charges from one plate to other plate. Which charges move? Electrons only move actually. Electrons move from this plate A to B, like this through the battery cell. Electrons only go, but we don't talk about the electrons only to talk about the positive charge motion. So positive charge motion talking means what we say is this potential difference of the cell is now what in terms of the this uh, capacitor, this the arrangement capacitor, what it says is is nothing but equal to work done to move the positive charge, inner positive charge from positive plate to negative plate. Okay, so that is work done to move the charge from positive plate to negative plate is given as the potential difference across the arrangement of these two plates, parallel plates, is called the capacitor. Capacitance is a principle or method. It is a method that we discuss. Capacitance is a device which can move the charges. So, capacitor moves the charges. There is a relation of this charge on the plates and what is the difference between the plates? That is B. And in case it increases the distance, more attachment will be there, more charges can be stored. There is a distance more, but uh, there is a limit beyond this. Uh, if the charges are increased beyond number, then they jump from minus to plus, gets moved by in all the cases. Here also, when the charge of increases, the jump, when the jump from minus to plus, all the discharges take place, neutralizes take place. Here, if you take the insulator also to be clean, that is possible to neutralize. But the insulator can insert a direct strength, direct constant, depending on that, that will not take the charge back. So, from minus to plus, A is then they can go. So, what we do is, A direct constant is 1 only. So, we choose the material with the direct constant to go M1. In this case, if I take the plates, it's separated by direct. Now I am making the direct complete liquid. First of all, this is complete liquid. Direct of constant K. Then what happens? Uh, this metal gets polarized. The electric gets polarized. The electric field is equal to plus no? minus. The electric is placed between the two plates A and B, and the electric gets polarized. Uh, and uh, this plate has a positive charge for clarity purpose. We are drawing a small gap. This is a plus charge. Here are minus charge. Okay, same number, 3, 2, 4. But on the metal plate, same number. But dielectric power is different. So what happens is the charge is used on the dielectric power and the charge on this will be minus, 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 plus, plus, plus. This is not a free charge because it's not a conductor. On the dielectric, what you find is the molecules will rotate or not in the molecules, the polarization takes place with the plus minus separations, etc. You get the polarizing charge density from the surface. These are not features, they cannot go to the plate. Even if the plate is touching us, they don't go, they stay there. The what happens now, there is this plus minus attraction still there because of this plus minus induction of our polarized charges. And electric decreases between the two plates. 
Everything decreases with two grades. Sir. But the uh, advantage is that charges cannot pass through this diaper easily because it's thin film. So by taking very thin surface, then you take a plastic sheet only, but a thin sheet will be made, not very big thin glass or like this here drawn. Very thin surface is there, so that the thin thickness is less means the resistance less. Resistance less means attracting more, more charges can be stored. So this other thing is called the capacitor. So to increase the capacitor of the conductor, what we have to do is one is keep the neutral plate close to this. Okay, you can increase the capacitance. Other thing is keeping the under conductor near to the charging plate. We can increase the capacitor of the conductor by this method also. Capacitor increase means one here in this case later you keep on adding the voltage and this other the capacitor. Here one other thing is taking the two plates, two plates supported by directly and connecting to the battery. Okay. In that case, also the electric constant increases, the capacitance increases by k times, k is the constant, more k is the electric you're taking, more capacitance will be there to hold the charges. Here, therefore, everything is done, we are done, we are taking only the battery to connect the two plates. Here, the single plane capacitance we are discussing, here we are discussing is combined in two plates together, increase the capacitance. So, by keeping the directly to the two parallel plates, two plates, metal plates, in the parallel, two metal plates, Okay, so by keeping the reality with two metal plates and connecting the plates to the battery, the charges can be stored on the surfaces. Inner surfaces will be charged and stored, charges are not stored on the outer surfaces. Because the attraction they go and stay inner surfaces only but not the outer surfaces. So this is the capacitance. So now this one capacitance coming back, we discuss the electric base here. Or what happens to the potential if you keep the negative charge, what are the potential if you keep the positive charge? On any surface you will point charge. Point charge will be different as V equal to Q by 4 by 402. Uh, we have discussed already this point. R is distance from the charge. So, potential because of the charge Q is V equal to Q by 402. If Q is false, V is false. If Q is negative, V is negative. So, I take one sphere for conductor. If I add the charges to this, if I add plus charge, plus Q, what are they? Adding plus charge is zero here at once. Add plus Q, potential V increases because positive is higher point than zero. So, if I add positive charge, the potential of conductor increases. So if I add positive charge, V increases, potential increases in components. If I add negative charge, what happens? Minus charge means adding electrons. If I add negative charge, potential will decrease. Minus V, if you add it again, potential will decrease. Okay. So in order to decrease, say that the capacitor can be increased. We are talking basically the conductor which has the priority to the positive charge. The capacitor can be increased by keeping, uh, by decreasing its potential. Potential and potential. How can you decrease the potential? By adding negative charge, not to the conductor, around it. So if you keep the negative charge near to the surface, negative charge near to the surface, because the negative charge around this, we have a negative potential. Negative potential means potential to least decrease below zero. Potential decrease means this capacitance increases. So around this potential decrease means this capacitance increases. But under plate, we are increasing the potential by adding the positive charges. We can add. Okay, basically, this is the place of the positive charges only in this case. But principle to talk is in terms of the angle So if you take the angle connector, this can be plus or minus also applicable. If you take minus, then what happens to these charges is it becomes plus charge. Okay, capacitor now capacitor the conductor to hold the heat charge also increases by keeping the other conductor close to it. Okay, that is the principle of capacitance. Principle of capacitance is for one more question. Let's go to this. Yes, sir. Can you tell me what is the difference between the conductor and the conductor? The charge can be increased by keeping the F conductor by keeping F conductor near to it, near to it, but without touching this, without touching the other conductors. Okay, and the method what I discussed again once again, and this is the next class. Cap what is capacitor? Capacitor is also called the condenser, and it is used to hold the charges. Okay, in this case we have the two plates. Sir. Actually, one plate means thin aluminum sheet, and between them one insulated sheet is called thin or paper is used, dry paper is used. Paper so the directly is used between the two aluminum sheets. Aluminum sheet, paper, aluminum sheet. And they are rolled into the cylinder. It's not a cylindrical shape, it is a parallel paper. Parallel plates will be there. So if I keep this in the if I connect this with power supply, charge and storing input. Given on time, we store the charges. Now, charges are stored at the voltage of 230 volts. If a time is to, the charges will be discharged. Means plus become whatever plus or minus now. Electrons will go to the plus, then pink. You can generally there is loss of energy that cannot end to spark. It means light energy, sound energy, just like the lightning case now. There are also small spark is produced. There is a lot of discharge in the capacitor.
Porque acá es el tercer servicio. 